Hello, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to use uh, the dynamic patrol modules. What this does is it lets y your game choose which patrol your group will take and it adds a bit more randomness into the game. So first thing you want to do, change your editor's layout to traditional so it's the same as mine. Now over here click F6, double click on the map and we want to name this marker WP WP1. Click OK. Press Control C and Control V to copy it. And just change the number to two. Repeat until you've got four. Or however may, many waypoints you want your patrol to have. So when you've done that, press F7 select modules under misc go to skirmish init click ok but double click place down a dynamic patrol so here in route 1 inside the brackets we want to write down all our marker names uh, these markers will be the waypoints for the group um, remember to use speech marks for the markers so speech mark WP1 close speech mark comma speech mark WP2 close speech mark comma and repeat until you've got all your markers listed you want to be careful not to put a comma after the last one because that will break it under debugs select root markers this will just show on the map whether these, this dynamic patrol has worked. Click OK. Ungroup these. Now place down a AI group which you want the dynamic patrol to give patrol markers to. Press F5 for synchronize. Synchronize the skirmish unit back to the dynamic patrol. Dynamic patrol back to the team leader or group leader. Now let's preview this. So when you've joined the game, press M, and on the map you will see the waypoint markers. So that's the dynamic patrol, although it's not very dynamic yet. We could have just done that with normal waypoint markers. So to make it dynamic, what we're going to do is place down more waypoints or markers. I'm just going to call these W1 up to W4. and these markers are going to go off in this direction so we can tell if they've chosen a different route so go back into the direct patrol and you want to input these markers into the route 2 just like we did before the order that you write them in will be the order that the patrol takes So. In this case, they will go to waypoint marker 2, then 3, and then they'll go back to waypoint marker 1, and then finally waypoint 4. Click OK. And repeat this process for route 3. So I'm going to call this one P1 up to P4. Speech mark P1, close speech mark, comma, speech mark P2, close speech mark, up to your, f your final waypoint marker. Okay. So as you can see, they've selected the southern patrol route this time, and the AI will follow this route. Now I'm going to show you how to add another uh, another patrol. Simply the same thing as before. So to save time, I'm just going to highlight this group, 
press Control C to copy and Control V. So this is identical, it's got the same uh, marker sets and all you want to do is synchronize the dynamic patrol back to the dynamic back to the skirmish unit. It's important that you don't have more than one skirmish unit on the map. So now we've got two groups hopefully taking different patrol groups patrol routes although they might both take the same route. So there you can see they've both selected different routes. So I hope you f hope you find this tutorial useful and I'll see you next time.